<laughs> Yo, there's a song that's been ringing, ringing, ringing to me. Um, there's a song by J. Cole, um, No Role Models, right? And the message that I've been getting from this song, I've been getting like multiple different like downloads about a self-fulfilling prophecy for somebody. Um, this could be good or bad, so we'll get into what the self-fulfilling prophecy, but the song where he talks about um, when he says, search through my memory, my memory, I couldn't find, no role models, no role models to speak of, search through my memory, my memory, I couldn't find one. So it's like, some of you have really been, had no fucking role models in your life to make you be the person that you are, to have the values that you hold in your life, whether this is how you uh, work with your children, how you handle your life, your household, the way you live your life. It's like somebody didn't have no role models. And it's like in those times of having the people, the, the people around you that were supposed to like be a role model, they wasn't the ideal role models for you. Even in those moments, there was like an energy where you still like something in you was still pushing you to believe that you can have whatever it is you want for your life to be as Delulu, whatever it is you're trying to do with your life, whatever, how you imagine things to be, you still had this uh, ability to still see it for yourself. Even when people was trying to knock you down on your goals, was trying to say that it's not going to happen or your friends or your family trying to make it seem like you, you, you tripping like I see a self-fulfilling prophecy coming forth and to and for somebody like the energy is so, so, so right. Like, and I keep seeing the planet Jupiter. So somebody could be a heavy Sagittarius energy or a fire sign, Aries, Leo or a Sagittarius energy. Okay. And Saturn energy as well. I'm also seeing Capricorn. Okay. You could be a Capricorn, have this aspect in your chart. Don't necessarily have to be, it's just, just the energy that I'm seeing right now. But this is self-fulfilling prophecy that has come or will be coming true for somebody. Okay. Because you held the faith because you knew in your own mind, even when chaos is around you, you believe that everything will be okay okay no matter what and so it is okay i don't know who this is for but this is the energy i've been getting like this energy of a self-fulfilling prophecy like when you have your thoughts so hyper focused and your feelings is all mixed into that this creates a manifestation for somebody okay i'm telling you somebody is manifesting success you told, yo, somebody had even told people from your past because with the No Role Models song, it talks about having no role models in love, no ho having no role models in life to be an, a functionable adult for somebody, whether you didn't have, you had an absent father, an absent mother, or absent family, okay? Like, there wasn't people to guide you, whether you're a male or a female, you still have the self-fulfilling prophecy of success that's coming through for somebody. Okay, 314, 315 is on the clock. This could be birthdays, okay? You be Pisces energy also, all right? But this is heavily guided by the angelic realms for somebody, okay? Someone is mastering their skills, okay? Someone is harnessing some super, supersonic creative energy, okay? And this is going to help you achieve your goals, especially if someone has been doing some type of manifestation abilities through this eclipse energy, this lunar eclipse energy that's coming through for somebody this past full moon. Okay, somebody must have been doing something, okay, whether that's reevaluation or whatever. Somebody is manifesting success. Or this is just your 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 um sign that your your thoughts, the things that you speak over your life is a self-fulfilling prophecy. So speak only good and positive things over your life. Okay, and do not worry. Always know that things are working for your highest good no matter what it looks like. Cuz then you will manifest success. This is for somebody, okay? Your name can start with an F, okay? Freya could be very significant, the color green or brown could be very significant wealth is here okay also you can be born in june june 29th or to june 14th so you can also cancer or gemini energy all right someone's being guided to take charge okay especially with this self-fulfilling prophecy okay this is i told you these two different energies this is someone who's also there is two people there's someone who's manifested success because they kept their mind and their thoughts and their emotions on to the level of positivity and this is also a warning for those who are trying to manifest this but they they have these conflicting thoughts in their head which can lead to a self-fulfilling pro prophecy for somebody this is why spirit is saying take charge of your thoughts have gratitude because gratitude is a very very high vibration 
condition and will attract what you want in your life. Okay, pray for what you need and know it's going to come no matter what. Okay, it looked like because you... You went through a heavy transformation in your relationships, okay? In the relationship department for somebody. Like, someone went through a huge transformation where they had to sit there and reevaluate why they attract, the type of people they attract, why they get the certain situations that they get. There was a few, a huge uh, transformation. Dragonflies would be very significant for somebody. Someone's very fucking magical, okay? Someone's very fucking magical and let go the past. This is what's transforming, okay, for somebody. I feel like somebody had to go through so many different lessons, so many, and it's how you have to be strong with this elephant energy. You had to move with your ancestors with this, uh, with this elephant energy. Also, Ganesh could be very significant. Someone had to move past blockages. This could have been people, places, things, thoughts, the way how you used to live your life. Okay, this was a personal choice for you. You chose this, and this is why you chose to go in a different direction, okay? Whether it was too hard or not, the mountains are being moved, okay? Didn't I say it? I'm talking about these miracles. I'm talking about you being playful in your energy and manifesting your best life. You are being the inventor, okay? The creator, the director of your, of your new life that you are really trying to manifest. This is really beautiful, yo. This energy has been coming through heavy, and I don't know who this is for. But you are getting guided by your guardians, okay? You are heavily guarded. You are heavily guided, okay? So trust whatever you're being led to because I'm telling you, you are being guided by the most high, by your angels and your ancestors. Let's see if any other letters come through. Okay, the letter B could be very significant. You could be born in February or you could be part of, this could be your born in a second. 10th could be very significant. So October, somebody could be seeing 10, 10, okay, as well. All right. Also, the letter L is here. So you could be seeing 333 or you could, your name could start with a C or you could be born in March. Okay, this is very significant for somebody. You could be born in May, August on the 15th or you could be 44 years old. This is for someone specific. I hope this reading helped you and I hope that you have a beautiful, blessed day if you like the book a person reading with me you can contact me at conscioustequeen at gmail.com i love you guys bye